it is a case of reverse Bredon cycle. In the case of reverse Bredon cycle, the process 1 to 2 is isentropic compression, 2 to 3 is constant pressure heat rejection, 3 to 4 is isentropic expansion and 4 to 1 is constant pressure heat addition. The values of the pressure limits are given as lower pressure as 1.2 bar and the higher pressure as 15 bar. And at the entry of the compressor, the temperature is given as 283 Kelvin and the exit of <coughs> the con of the cooler is given as 298 Kelvin. Now, we have to calculate the value of volume of air handled by the compressor and the expander. Okay, so volume, we have to calculate the value of V1 and V4 in meter cube per second so v1 dot and v4 dot okay so by using pv is equal to mrt equation mrt1 upon p1 and this is m dot r t4 upon p4 okay so the value of r is known the value of p1 and p4 as g1 and the value of T1 is given. Now we have to calculate the unknown factor is mass flow rate first and second factor is T4. Okay. So by using isentropic expansion process 3 to 4, it is equal to P3 upon P4 raised to power gamma minus 1 upon gamma and T3 is given as 298 T4. P3 is given as 15 upon 1.2 bar. The value of gamma for air is 1.4 upon one point gamma minus 1 upon gamma. So, therefore, the value of T4 is 144.81, 144.81 Kelvin. Now, the only unknown is mass flow rate. Now, please read the question. The cooling load is given as 50 kilowatt. So, with the help of this RC, we will get the values of mass flow rate. So, RC. Rc is equal to m dot into Re and Rc is equal to uh, h1 minus h4. As the working fluid is air and air is treated as ideal gas, so for an ideal gas enthalpy is a function of temperature. So m dot into Cp T1 minus T4. So the Rc is given as 50 kilowatt. The only unknown factor is m dot in this equation. The value of Cp of air is 1.005 kilojoule per kg Kelvin. And the value of T1 is G1 and T4 is already calculated as 144.81. Okay. So, by using this equation, we will get the values of M dot as 0.36 kg per seconds. Okay. And the value of R is 0.287 kilojoule per kg Kelvin. And the value of pressure P1 and P4 are the constant pressure process so 1.2 bar now use all these factor the values of m dot mass flow rate uh, are characteristic gas constant p1 and p4 and <coughs> and t1 and t4 in this equation to get the values of volume flow rate okay So, after using all the parameters, we will get the values of volume flow rate is, is 0.24 meter cube per second and at the exit is 0 0.12 meter cube per second. So, these are the final answers.